history of two generations of crime. The drama of absolute power and the men who violate it. The Godfather, part two. What is your name? Don Vito Corleone and his son, Michael. Both had seen the ones they loved most cut down before their eyes. Both had killed as an act of vengeance. Both commanded the most powerful and merciless crime organization in the world. Is it true that in the year 1950, you devised the murder of the heads of the so-called five families in New York? It's a complete falsehood. They would take any measures. I mean, you've won. Do you want to wipe everybody out? I don't feel I have to wipe everybody out, Tom. It's just my enemies. Make any arrangement. Michael, we're bigger than U.S. Steel. Order any death to protect the empire they controlled. The Godfather and his heir. Both were men of ice, and both were targets. Please, please stay inside. Keep them alive. We'll try. Michael, alive! The Godfather, part two, is Sicily in 1921. <laughs> and Nevada in 1958. It is revolution in Havana and rub outs in New York. It is manipulation. It would be like trying to kill the president. There's no way we can get to it. If anything in this life is certain, if history's taught us anything, it says you can kill anyone. It is murder. It is betrayal. It was a son, a son, and I had it killed because this must all end. The Godfather, part two, is the final chapter in the violent history of the Corleone crime family. It is the motion picture masterpiece of the year.